Great day, great day, good day. I am just glad to be here today. So one of the things that I thought about in doing this video today, I wanted to reflect on something that I heard over the last two or three days. As I was with a group of my Ruths, as their mother and Naomi Rowe, and we were talking about some of the things that we look back and see how in the world did we make it through and just look back and see how many people may have come and gone in our lives. And that's really what it, what it amounts to. So I thought about, okay, when we do this grief community, my purpose is that it will have you feeling and realizing that the things that you are going through and so one of the things that I thought about was that I am most certainly an intercessor for those that are grieving. That's what my channel is about. My channel is made of ministry. My channel is made of motivation. My channel is made of inspiration. And my channel is made of intercession. So at any time, you can expect me to pop up with one of those subjects. Today, I'm really interested in how you feel about intercession. One of the things that we shared with each other was what we felt like we did best in intercession. And actually, the book that we are reading had some wonderful ideas on intercession and who we think we are and who the other thing is who people think we are. If you've ever had anybody say, uh, I know that you are, or I think that you are, or I believe that you are, and so I am basing my actions on what I believe, what I think, uh, and my feelings, even though feelings is not really a good word because feelings go and come, and sometimes they are not true indicators of your heart. But, so, one of the things that I know I am is a list intercessor. You can look at all of the books that I have in my house where my friends give me coloring books, uh, meditation books for, with, for color and uh, prayer scriptures for color because they know I enjoy listing name, patient, parents, oh, I say patients, everybody, person's name because I'm person-centered. Uh, person's name in my book and sometimes during the day I will just go in and pray for that group of people for that day and so I'm thinking about I never thought about it, that I'm a list in intercessor but in grief you will have those that will send you beautiful words and in those words you will be able to pull out uh, so many I guess good good ways to, to deal with the day. And so that's what grief is. It's a day by day dealing. And so I am just glad that I'm able to get on the channel uh, to share with you uh, our book, Redeeming Grace. Look how far God has brought us. I know that you know that it's on Amazon, not only in paperback, but an e-book. So I'd like for you to take the time to after you read and see this video, uh, just to take the time and check it out and see what you think about it. It is a book of love. It The first chapters uh, involve my husband and his thoughts on returning back from close to death uh, in a situation. And also, we have people who are sharing their great stories about family members and sharing their great stories about their journey. And I always think about that because that's the th last card that my husband shared with me was on the journey, the joy of the journey. So, Redeeming Grace, look how far God has brought us, the joy of the journey. I also have another book on called Skies of Myself, Soul and Spirit, Psalms for My Delight. And I'd really like you to take, check that out. And let's just come back again very soon.